Hi there, everyone. I'm meteorologist Ashley Baylor with a check of your latest forecast. It is going to be a little bit cooler as we go into your Monday. Yes, we will have lots of sunshine out there, but the winds will be a little bit stronger out of the north, so that is going to keep highs in the upper 50s to low 60s. We'll tap out at about 59 degrees in Nags Head. Look for a high of 61 in Edenton. Across the south side, sunny but cool. 60 degrees in Virginia Beach, only about 56 degrees in Norfolk, 59 in Suffolk. Across the peninsula, that cool northerly breeze will keep highs closer to 56 degrees in Yorktown, 56 expected in Hampton as well. About 62 in Williamsburg, points north of that and along the eastern shore. We'll have a high of 55 in Chincoteague and 56 degrees in Gloucester. Don't forget, Tuesday is Election Day. I'm sure you're definitely not forgetting that. Uh, but here's a look at what you can expect throughout the day. The polls will open at 6 o'clock, and at that point, we will have sunshine. Well, the sun will be coming up right around then, with temperatures right around 42 degrees. We'll quickly warm into the low 60s by noon, and then by the time the polls close at 7, we'll mainly clear skies with temperatures around 50. 8 degrees, so a very quiet day uh, for Election Day. Wednesday, expect more of a mix of sun and clouds with temperatures right around 67. A cold front will drop through on Wednesday, but it will be a relatively weak cold front. We have dropped the chance for any spotty showers out there. Behind that front will be down to 60 degrees on Thursday, 65 in full sunshine for a Veterans Day on Friday. And then as we look ahead to next weekend, it will be quite a bit cooler with highs only in the low to mid 50s.